okay, which order pairs a solution of this system? So we can solve this algebraically or on a graph and calculator. We'll do both. So if they're if they're um, going to have a solution at some point, an ordered pair, it's just a point where they're equal. Well, then at some point these two things are equal. So 3x minus 15. Let's find when it equals x squared minus x minus 20. So to solve this, I would add 15 and subtract 3x from both sides. So minus 3x plus 15. This cancels out to 0 equals x squared minus 4x um, minus 5. So now when we factor this, we want to find factors of negative 5 that add up to negative 4. And I know that if I take um, uh, negative 5 times positive 1, that multiplies to negative 5, but adds to negative 4. So I'm going to use those two numbers. And this equals 0. So automatically, then this means that um, x minus 5 is equal to 0, or and or x plus 1 equals 0. In both cases, solve for x. Add 5, x is 5, subtract 1, x is negative 1. So this just means that um, the x values when these two uh, functions meet are 5 and negative 1. So we can cross out choice 3 and 4 from our list. Those don't have, uh, choice 3 has 0. And we can cross out choice 1 because it has negative 5, but we need positive 5. So now, to find out what the actual point is, plug in the simplest value to the simplest equation, because here all things are equal. So let's do the line. 3 times 5 minus 15. So that's 15 minus 15. It's 0. So the point is 5, 0. Right? That's one of our points. I don't see it listed. Try the other point. Try negative 1. 3 times negative 1 minus 15. So it's negative 3 minus 15, that's negative 18, so the point is negative 1, negative 18, and that point is here, choice 2. On the graphing calculator, go to y equals here, clear these functions out, enter in 3x minus 15, that's our line, press enter, clear off any functions that are there, hit x squared, press the right key to get out of the exponent, minus x minus 20, Okay, graph. Okay, so this is showing part of it. I'm going to zoom out so we can see the whole thing here. But here you want to cho choose the center around which you're actually zooming. Okay, enter. Alright, so we get a better picture of it here. And you can see that it crosses twice, but if you want to find exactly, hit second trace, hit 5 for intersect. Here you have to kind of toggle around to select um, once on the line, and then up or over, just to get on the, the curve there, press enter, and then it's asking for a guess, yes. And there's the, the intersection, negative 1, negative 18. If you want to find the second intersection, scroll over to this right area to find this intersection as well.